All right, here in the Piedmont today, we had clouds like, like, like we'd had every day lately, but we went over to some sunshine this afternoon. We've got enough sunlight to push us back into the mid 80s. So we had a warm afternoon out there, 86 degrees, 71 this morning. That was 10 degrees warmer than yesterday. Right now, we've got 70s and low 80s being reported, 81 in Winston. Everybody else mostly upper 70s. Greensboro, 78 high points at 79 along with Asheboro. Denton's a little cooler. I'll show you why in just a moment. 80 degrees in Yanceyville, and we've got 70 degrees up in the Wilkesboro's. Denton's a little cooler because there were some showers and thunderstorms that went by nearby and a little shower up to Denton. Heavier weather is still across parts of Montgomery County. Nothing severe. This cell is weakening now, but it was quite a bit stronger earlier when it came out of East Tennessee and then into the western part of North Carolina and started to die out as it moved southeast. But you can see there were some downed trees northwest of Charlotte and quite a few reports of some uh, severe weather back over in Tennessee and parts of North Georgia. Those areas were under a level two threat today and they still are level one threat between here and the Charlotte area and then from the triad north of level zero. And that was a couple hours ago when that was put out and everything's weakening now. So the threat's really going away, as you can see on here. Now, on the weather map, the front to the north is going to stay to the north, and the heat from the west is going to continue to build our way. So tomorrow and again Thursday are going to be hot days. Friday, Saturday are going to be hot days as well. So we're going to be seeing a lot of that. Do want to show you the tropics. We're going to be talking about the tropics pretty much every night, probably for the next couple of months as we're moving into the meat of the season. August and September into early October is typically their busiest time in the tropical Atlantic. And uh, this little disturbance right here with some clouds and showers approaching the Windward Islands, nothing but just a few harmless showers right now. But the Hurricane Center believes that in the next seven days, not the next two, but the next seven, that this could develop into a tropical system, a depression or greater. Uh, chances of it reaching a depression, which is the minimal, is 60%. But uh, still got a long ways to go, and right now the computer models aren't real supportive on that. So we'll see how it plays out. Our beach forecast is 89 and 90 with partly cloudy skies next two days. Water is in the low 80s most locations except for the northern outer banks where they have a labrador current that keeps them cooler, 73. 83 in the mountains tomorrow and 84 degrees on Thursday. Mountains do have a 50% chance for a shower or storm at some point tomorrow. 71 degrees overnight in the Piedmont. And then for tomorrow, again, we'll see a chance for a shower or thunderstorm, otherwise partly cloudy and a hot day at 93. The chance tomorrow is at 30%, 20% on Thursday, 30% Friday. So the chances are not zero, but they're very low. 50% chance of activity on Saturday, then 40% chance Sunday. So Sunday, Saturday is our most likely day, but you see the stretch of 90s and then we're close to 90 after that. 8 to 12 days out. We're still flirting with 90 degrees every day. Chances for a shower storm at 25 to 40%. So no big chances, but some chance. Three degree guarantee tonight's low 71. My guarantee for today was for 70. It was 71 and our streak at the moment is at 60 days.